One other thing, Andy, to talking about West Hills, they are similar to Brawley in that eight of their starters go both ways. So tonight could be a war of attrition. All right, 8.05 to go. The clock is running in motion, and they're going to go with the pitch. And here comes Lassos. Lassos is headed for the end zone, breaks the tackle, touchdown, Wildcats. Spencer Moyer now under center, Andy, with trips, three wide receivers to the right, and he puts a man out to the left, throws over the middle. Oh, and almost intercepted by Moises Lassos. Lassos saw that one coming. 5.49 to go as the clock stops, and here goes Moyer. They go in after him, and the ball is just overthrown again. So a little bit out of sync are the West Hills Wolfpack, a trick punt that ended up being a pass. Moyer has somebody out in the flat and he beats Moses Lassos and there is a touchdown. That's the exact play that they used against Imperial in the opening drive last week, Andy. Uh, Zen Jones and we'll try to get him a chair because it's gonna be a little bit of a while. And here's the pitch and that's to uh, number 28, Austin Gutierrez. Yep. And Gutierrez. And he was hit up high in the head and yes. he is not getting up so they're gonna call a personal foul on that one. And here we go, there's Andrew Ortiz, and Ortiz finds his way in for a touchdown. Okay, well, that's the best revenge Brawley can come up with, Andy. Yep. But meanwhile, the Wildcats have a first and 15, and here's Ross Rubio, he's at the 40, the 45 to 50, the 40, turns it back and is into the West Hills territory. He's at the Wolfpack 38 yard line. And Ortiz is gonna get it, and he's still on his feet. He breaks a couple of tackles. Touchdown, Wildcats. On a back. Holy Toledo. A bunch of guys on the line of scrimmage, and it doesn't do him any good. As here, breaks it loose. And that is on if he's on the 40. That's Nathan Suits. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. Hold on to that football. He is down to the 13-yard line. They sent everybody, and Nathan Suits is able to get past the point of attack. Here we come back quickly. Here's Andrew Ortiz. Ortiz breaks the hard tackle. Touchdown, Wildcats. And Andrew is fired up, I'll tell you what. And they, wow. Right, one receiver to the left, and Moyer goes back. He's got plenty of pressure. He's got a man open, and the ball, nice. Nice. I don't know if that was defense or not. Yeah, it was. Probably. Nice coverage by the Wildcats. No, that's the that. same formation. Single back. Trips right. Single receiver left. And Brawley throws. Yeah. Oh, what nice. a tip. What a tip. Holy, who was that? Moyer. Back to pass. Pump fakes. Throws deep. Has a man open. Intercept. And it's intercepted. And he's still on his feet. Here comes number three. That's uh, Kevin Kastner. Oh, and I very that got to be a flag on that one. The, he is hit by somebody just off the field. And I'll tell you what, there better be a flag on that one. And there isn't. You're listening to exciting Wildcat football on 1300. Talk oh, it's hard snap, oh, and it's he's a bad right. snap, and he's not ready, and Brody has it. Holy Toledo. <laughs> oh. 21 yard line attempting the field goal, so it'll be a 31 yard attempt. Ross calls for the ball. The snap is down, the kick is up, and the kick is good. <laughs> and, uh, back to pass is Amon. He throws in the end zone. Oh, and it's caught. Coming down with it, number 22. Uh, suits there, and 22 gets up rather gingerly, and Brawley's defense wants, doesn't want him to score. There is no, no good blood between these two teams, I'll tell you that, Andy. No. 34 Shaws in there. They put a man in motion. They're going to block and give it to Shaw, and Shaw is going to get in for the touchdown. So Ross and Rubio takes it. Takes he will a knee. take a knee, and that's it. Okay, the Brawley High Wildcats in a thoroughly dominating performance beat the West Hills Wolfpack by a score of 29 to 13. That you have been listening to exciting 2014 Brawley High Wildcat football.